Panda 3D uses the same coordinate system as Blender. So where the x-axis goes horizontally, so from left to right, the y-axis goes into the depth, so away from the view or into the view, and the z-axis goes up and, and down, so vertically. So as you can see here in Blender, this red line shows the x-axis and this greenish line shows the y-axis which goes away from the view or the camera. And the z-axis is, is not shown here, but it goes up and down. Here is the uh, is this uh, widget which shows the x, y and z-axis. And the same coordinate system is used in Panda 3D. So here uh, we have this scene and I also disabled the mouse controls and uh, I'm just going to quickly draw here something. I'm going to... Um, I'm going back soon. Okay, so I'm just going to draw something here to just to show you. So the x-axis goes... let's draw it as um, red. So the x-axis goes here is the middle of the screen, so the zero, zero. So this is zero and zero. And the x-axis goes right, this is positive. And can I make this a little bit thicker? So the x-axis goes right, this is positive, and also left. So this is the negative x and the y axis or the for now for the z axis which is blue goes up so this is positive and goes down so this is negative and as i said this is the center of the of the viewport or, or the screen so this box is centered not centered but it goes from zero zero and as i say the y goes away so this if we rotate a screen this will be this axis so this will be the positive and this will be the negative y so okay so just let um, just for short uh, why i i'm here i'm just going to click here and uh, here when we moved the boxes position to 0 10 and 0 we moved on the y axis so we we, we moved it back on this axis on this axis 10 units and when we moved the panda here negative 2 10 and 0 we, mo we moved it negative 2 on x mm, here so negative 2 some somewhere here and on the on x and 10 on y so back um, I'm, so somewhere here And of course, I, this is just a <laughs> rough drawing, but uh, uh, understanding the coordinate system is crucial to actually understand how to place and rotate and also move characters in your 3D world. So if you understand how Blender's um, coordinate system work, works, you will understand also how Panda's coordinate system works.